What is the sun? The sun is a nearly perfect ball of hot plasma, heated to incandescence by Earth's magnetic field. It is considered a plasmoid. What is plasma? Plasma is the fourth state of matter. It is a supercharged gas. This experiment uses a microwave, some tin foil, and a glass beaker. Plasma can be hot, and it can also be cold. What is a plasmoid? A plasmoid is a combination of plasma and magnetic fields. You can manipulate plasma in many ways, using a magnetic field and frequencies. Many scientists agree that 99% of the observable universe is made of plasma. What is a particle accelerator? It is a series of thousands of superconducting magnets over a large area. A superconducting magnet is an electromagnet made from coils of superconducting wire. They must be cooled to cryogenic temperatures during operation. LHC is comprised of over 1200 superconducting magnets. According to the International Atomic Energy Agency, more than 30,000 accelerators are in use around the world. This map shows the location of some particle accelerators. Can a particle accelerator intensify the sun and cause record-breaking heat waves? If the sun is a local plasmoid in Earth's magnetic field, then yes, it can. Inside this light bulb is plasma. Watch as it intensifies when it is in close proximity to the magnet. Heat waves are pushing temperatures to their highest levels ever recorded. It has reached over 40 degrees in parts of Europe, North America, Asia and the Middle East. Wildfires have been burning out of control. Experts say heat waves like this have become more frequent because of climate change caused by humans. Is there evidence? that particle accelerators are to blame? Yes. Let's take a look at the three areas on Earth with the worst heat waves in 2022. Now let's compare that to the location of three of the largest particle colliders in the world. Here is a video from North Africa, 2017. A strange solar event near the particle accelerator in Saudi Arabia can be seen. توسط الآن القمر توسط الشمس This next video is from our friends in Paris, July 2022 Very close to the LHC I'll do it in English also, it's the apocalypse in Paris, so if you're a tourist, don't come. <laughs> don't come. <laughs> we don't know what the fuck is going on, but it's like, it's like a, the, the city is burning down, but there's no fires, it's really weird. 
it's like 40 degrees or so. Really bizarre, my man. Okay, pray for me, guys, in case you don't hear from me, and uh, I suffocated it. Take care. Let's take a closer look at the temperature anomalies in Europe over the past 40 years and see if there's a connection with CERN. This data suggests that a plasmoid, like our sun, can be affected by a series of large, superconducting, dipole magnets. Further study is urgently needed. A reassessment of the sun's size and distance from Earth is also required. I know you're out there. I can feel you now. I know that you're afraid. You're afraid of us. You're afraid of change. I don't know the future. I didn't come here to tell you how this is going to end. I came here 